Hey guys, welcome back to the business of art. Today we're going to go over sponsorships and kind of what that means, some different kinds of sponsorships and how you could possibly go about getting them. So first of all, there are a lot of different types of sponsorships and sponsorships for all different kinds of things. So there's art supplies, of course, as an artist, that's ideally what you want, but there's also even clothing, tech gadgets, makeup, um, candles, you know, like really all kinds of things. And then there's a lot of different kinds of sponsorships. Some companies will just send you free product. Um, other companies will send you free product and pay you. And other companies will actually make you into kind of like a brand ambassador where you are one of the like faces of the company. And so they'll give you free product, they'll pay you, uh, they may have you do appearances or whatever, you know, that's a little more intimate, long-term relationship. So um, sometimes companies will just send you a product to try out and then you can go from there and develop a relationship with them. So to start with, I would start by first of all, making a list of all of the products that you use and all of the companies that you're already using their products because that's a great place to start. Uh, second is pretty much what you're gonna need is a large social media following. The whole point of companies sponsoring you is that you're gonna basically help them promote their products. So if you do not have a following or an audience, then there's not you're not really gonna be able to help promote their products. Now that could be anywhere, that could be YouTube, that could be Twitter, that could be Facebook, Instagram, any social media platform, or all of them of course, but any one of them even. If you have, uh, you know, 100,000 Instagram followers, you're gonna be able to get sponsorships. Um, and different companies will be looking for different things. Some, you know, you may be able to start getting sponsorships at 5,000 or 10,000 followers. Uh, others will expect you to have 100,000 or 500,000 or, you know, even more, depending on what, what they're looking for. So if you have your, your list and you start building up your social media, uh, once you get to, I'd say even the, the thousands, start getting into the thousands mark, you can start actually approaching these companies if you'd like, you know, and say, Hey, I use your products. You know, are you willing to um, get me affiliate links or send me some additional product to try out and then, you know, I'll put the links to your company, et cetera, et cetera. You know what I mean? Because it's what you're already doing. You're already using their products. And then when you get larger, you'll likely have companies start contacting you, asking you to try out their products or to work with them, et cetera. So that you'll do at your own discretion. Um, I would research the company. If it's a company you're already well aware of, then, you know, go for it. One policy I personally have too, is I have to not only like the product, but I have to like the company. So if I, there have been times that I've tried out products and I love the products, but the company, I just didn't feel like I would be able to work well with them. So I didn't, and that's okay. And I've had other people approach me and say, hey, I will pay you you know, to mention my product on your channel and whatnot, and it just was something I wasn't really interested in. So there is that factor too. You do need to be able to keep your integrity in on that and, um, you know, keep your own counsel <laughs> of what is a good idea and what is not. Definitely don't sell out because then your followers will know. Your followers will no longer listen to you because they'll be like, oh, this, I can't really trust what they say. They're just, you know, telling me products so they can make money or whatever. You know what I mean? You have to be very transparent and honest. So um, I hope that was helpful. That goes into kind of some of the types of sponsorships and how to start getting them. But the biggest thing is you're gonna need to build up a social media following, whichever one you're the most comfortable with. And generally speaking around 10,000 is when companies start wanting to work with you as kind of, you know, sponsor you and kind of be an ambassador. You can kind of be an ambassador of their products. 
So hopefully that was helpful. I definitely say get out there and get it. Don't be afraid to ask for what you want. You know, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. <laughs> and you get some of the ones you do take. So you might as well try. It doesn't hurt. If they say no, they say no. If they say yes, awesome, you know. And uh, let me know if you have any questions. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time.